hi, I'm with uh, All American Vegan. Uh, we have a very different approach to uh, veganism than most of the groups. Uh, we realize that uh, despite uh, 50 years of the government and nonprofits trying to get Americans to eat healthy, uh, Americans are addicted to fast food. They don't want to give up the foods that they've grown up eating. So we are pushing vegan comfort foods. We are pushing the traditional American diet, foods like lasagna and fried chicken and hamburgers and tuna melts and macaroni and cheese only in delicious vegan versions. So that way people don't have to give up the patterns of eating and the foods that they uh, love to eat and we can offer them in uh, delicious vegan versions that uh, are not only uh, good for people but also good for animals and good for the planet because we realize that when we try to get people not only to stop eating animals but also to start eating healthier we create uh, two obstacles to overcome instead of just one. We're also uh, promoting the no-kill philosophy. We're trying to uh, get, uh, end the systematic killing of dogs and cats in our nation's shelters. Uh, and uh, it is uh, very common for vegan groups to ask, why is one animal uh, called your pet and the other animal called dinner? We're also asking the opposite. Uh, why, why is it wrong to uh, kill and eat a chicken, but it's okay to kill dogs and cats? Because unfortunately, a lot of animal welfare and animal rights groups uh, don't support uh, the no-kill philosophy and they do, they do legitimize the killing of dogs and cats and we believe that the way to get people to be more compassionate about all animals is to, get, is to first end the killing of those animals that are closest to us, uh, our dogs and cats, cherished members of our families. And once we get them to end the killing of dogs and cats, once we end it as a society, it's just a matter of time before that door swings further open and we embrace a larger compassion for uh, other animals who share our planet. Uh, so we have uh, three books. The first is our cookbook called All American Vegan. It is a, uh, filled with uh, a lot of delicious recipes, uh, foods that w we might find at a local diner and that we grew up eating. It's uh, got also has no vegetables. There's only one uh, one recipe with vegetables, and they're actually used as a garnish. Uh, we also have uh, redemption and irreconcilable differences. These are books that uh, talk about the no-kill movement in the United States and the very successful movement to end the killing of dogs and cats in shelters. There's now 25 no-kill communities across the United States and we believe that we will end the killing of dogs and cats in our lifetime.